Hi everyone, welcome to Real Embroidery. My name is Winnie and this is Nini. Uh, I'm with one of my cat today. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to make this little cute squirrel. This is actually a DIY kit, so it's much easier than the things I usually do. I thought it would be a good idea for me to show you how to use the fur painting technique to make the animal fern. Now, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. Really need your support, right? Me? This is how the kit looks like. Uh, there are instructions. And I'll say it comes with the hoop. A fabric already with pattern printed. Make sure you tighten it well. I will begin from those, this color. This is the bottom part of this squirrel. And usually when you make animal fern, you start from the bottom to the top. Yeah, this is going to be the same color, so I will just continue. Sorry, I have a talking cat. She likes to mail when I speak. So I'm using two strands here, although in the pattern they recommend to use three strands. Now I begin the bottom part. Uh, this is what I like to do. I like to start from the bottom and then slowly moving to the top and I try to keep every stitches in the similar length it's very similar to the long and short stitches but um, you can see I'm not really uh, I'm not really following a long and short pattern it's just quite random here but try to make many stitches so it looks more like fern You can see I'm using both of my hands here. I prefer to use both hands when I'm doing some patterns which is quite repetitive. Like the fern, it doesn't require too much precision. So uh, with both hands, I work much faster. And I embroider about 10 hours a day, literally from day to night. So. With just one hand, I won't be able to work so many hours. And here I'm just trying to stitch in between, so not covering the other color. It doesn't have to look perfect, just keep making many stitches. Sometimes uh, you can see some of my stitches, they are covering each other. And if you find a spot you feel like you can add more stitches, just go for it.
change to another color and start again to make this random stitch. There are no certain rules. You can start from the left, from the right, or from the middle. Just make sure all your stitches they are covering the fabric. Now I'm working on the face, following the directions marked on the pattern, so that makes it pretty easy. I do recommend beginners to just uh, get one of those kits. It can help you to save lots of time. You don't need to worry about how to trace the pattern on the fabric. You, can, you don't need to worry about the colors. You just start stitching. Simple as that. For the nose, we are going to use a satin stitch here. I'm also using uh, two strands and I find it much easier to start from the middle.
and do the same for the eyes. Start from the middle using satin stitch. I should probably start from the eyes, so then it will be a little bit easier, but it will still work. To finish all the black background, use uh, also two strands to make one French knot in the middle. This one is a little bit covered by the black color. Just pull it out a little and make it a little bit too tight. After that, finish the tail using the same method. Whiskers use one strand only to make an outline with back stitch. One stitch in, try to cover a bit of the previous stitch so that makes a smooth line. Okay, we have already finished this inner circle. So right now we will start to uh, make the two colors blend together. We'll make those few small petals. Here. 
I prefer to stitch out from an existing stitch. I find out this way the hole is the needle hole is slightly smaller. Soak in the water for 10 minutes. You don't need to do anything else special. And then wait for it to dry. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please feel free to leave a comment below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. If you're interested in this kit, you can find the link at the description below. See you next time.